want to support me, go to Nene Marie 37 on Instagram and purchase you a signed copy of my book. That's Nene Marie 37. Yo! It's your boy Trisha News, and I'm back at y'all with another one. Appreciate all the support. Thanks for everyone who subscribed to the channel. If you ain't sub to my channel, make sure you do. Make sure you join the membership. Shout out to the Real Mod Squad, man. If you ain't following my mods, make sure you follow their ads at the end of the video. Remember, if you got anything extra, I said extra, y'all. Food, hygiene, clothes, bag it up, take it outside, and give it to the less fortunate. Remember, we all one step away from being homeless. I don't care how much money you say you got or think what you think you got. Mother Nature could come through, man, destroy your shit, and you ain't got nothing, man. So make sure y'all get back. Hey, let's save the kids, man. Let's save the kids. When it's hot, man, people get shot. Know where your kids at, man. Parents, know where your kids at. Um, let's say the women, the children, the elderly, and the male civilians, man, who don't want to die, bro. It's Saturday, man. Happy Saturday to all. Make sure y'all safe, man. It's dangerous out there. With that being said, we have two stories, man. We have two main stories, and we're going to talk about Ace and Young, and if we got time. I will be going live tonight. Make sure y'all smash that like button for me, though. Um... 051 Big Fella has been arrested, man. 051 Big Big Fella has been arrested. He's got, got multiple charges. I think he's still fighting his murder case. I think he's still fighting the case, man. If I'm not mistaken, I think he's still fighting his case. And he was out on bond. This is the one who bonded out, got bonded out for the $100,000. And now he's back in jail on gun charges, um, uninsured vehicle. Um, um, drugs, marijuana, um, no license. They got him on a whole bunch of stuff, man. It ain't looking good. If he would have had a license and a gun, he probably could get a little leeway. But by him having a, by him being on a hundred k bond and all that, he might have forfeited that because it's a no cash bond now. So he bonded out before they did made it that. So yeah, he finna be in jail. Um, o five one a row, big fella, man, big fella. It's has been arrested, man. Um, yeah, yeah, young money, man. They they probably finna go back to in the inside the um cuckoo's nest, man. They got kiddo in jail. They got pre boy in jail. They got o five one rose in jail. They got um um who else they got? They got and they got him in jail now. So yeah, they got some they got some um big figures. Um, and they got o five one freaky in jail too. Hey, then my second story, man. Lil J, Lil J and Butter had a part two, y'all. Shout out to DJ U. First of all, I would just want to say that. Shout out to DJ U. The dude is a he's a goddamn genius, man. You know how to work it. But Lil J was on the phone with Butter, man. It sound like Lil J and Butter, man. They they gonna be cool again one day, bro. They gonna be cool again. All Lil J asking Butter is, to be honest, man, about his mother getting up. He 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 said he stressed that. You know, my mother got locked up, bro. I ain't had nobody when you when you got my mama locked up. You hear me? Cause she put out the picture of Butter sitting at the table um in a police station signing a paper. And and that that was tampering with um state evidence and it was tampering with a witness. Uh, you you put the witness in jeopardy. So Lil J was asking her, was he in Kankakee? Butter still lied about that, which he was in Kankakee. I remember when Butter was in Kankakee. He was calling the he was calling through the phone from Kankakee, the people I was around. He was in Kankakee County. Um, and Butter just won't let Jay, to be honest, about the Geechees. Butter got back on his ass this time, though. He was like, bro, if you effing boys, you know, you, 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 you got that, you know. Lil J, J, he want him to admit that. So, sound like they gonna get their relationship back. But it was funny, man, when he got the roasting DJ you, and then after that, he got on Truth Teller, man, and that shit was funny, man. He said, um, man, um, dude, let you do goof out, let you do it. Now, they can't be really mad at Truth Teller, bro, cause, you know, Butter went on there and said it. Who ain't gonna interview Butter and he saying this shit? Just like Lil J. I'ma interview Butter. If Butter would have said that on my platform, I would have interviewed him and got that information. You know what I'm saying? That's part of blogging. You know, it's messy, a little messy, but it's part of blogging, bro. They in the limelight. When they in the light, when they want to be famous, that's what happens. So he so he was like, what's dude name? Whole time he was talking about Truth Teller. He just didn't know his name. He was like, man, the blogger that looked like, um, um, what's the name? He's like, the blogger that looked like dude off um, Blue Streak, man, when he went in there with a pizza. Uh, special delivery. I got the crown like a motherfucker, bro. 
I'm Tom. He do look like Martin though, on that on that thing though. He got on Truth Teller ass though. But you can't be mad at Truth Teller at the end of the day because you know Truth Teller just doing. You know he just reporting about what he reporting about, bro. You know besides making up some shit sometimes. You know what I'm talking about because he said I had a um, told on a lot of murders. I ain't telling on no murders, no none of that. You know what I'm saying? And it's out. So you know. But other than that, yeah, Lil J, him and Butter got a part two. Make sure y'all check out that. Lil J and Butter Part 2, man. It's funny. It ain't funnier than the first one. Because Butter, Lil J was doing all the treating. But Butter was still talking over Lil J. He was like, my ear hurt. My ear hurt. My ear hurt. My ear hurt. That was telling Butter to be quiet, man. He trying to talk. You know what I'm saying? Butter kept on going around in circles the whole conversation. He kept on bringing up what somebody did to him. Jumped on him. And he had to stand on business and everything. He always go around shit. But yeah, if y'all ain't see that DJU interview... Go and check that out, man. He got out. He he was roasting DJU. He started off, and then you know, and then he you know him and Bud was talking, and then he the truth teller joke. That shit was funny as hell, man. Um, Young and Ace and I, Young and Ace, man. Um, I finally got his name right, Young and Ace. The man is crazy, bro. The man, the man want to go to jail. Hey, look, I'm gonna say it once again. Even if Young and Ace ain't got nothing to do with it. If he know or connected to the people or have talked to the people that was involved with the murder once they get grabbed. If he, if he involved with it, talk to them in any kind of way. It's called conspiracy, bro. He going to jail. The feds are involved. This is not a police. This is not a um, Tampa Bay police um, and, and all that shit, bro. If they, they, they use the interstate, they going to charge him with all that shit. That's what y'all need to understand. I know from a fan point of view, you want to say, oh, man, they can't use no lyrics. How many rappers that went fucking down, bro, that they use their lyrics already, that they hand court, that they plan the lyrics, bro? If your lyrics add up to the crime, bro, they're going to use them, bro. That's called evidence on their thing. So with that being said, man, Younger Nason, he a fool, man. No, nah, he probably ain't got nothing to do with it. But if you rapping about some shit that we doing, I would have told him and told him, like, nah, don't drop that video, bro. You know what I'm saying? I think it's hot right now. But ain't nobody doing that. But when everybody go to jail, then my first crown, like, man, you should never drop that goof-ass video. It's all good to your ass in there for the rest of your life. You know, but this Trisha News, my man is my nine. You want to support me, man, go to Nene Marie 37 on Instagram, man, and purchase you a signed copy of my book, man. I do sign it myself, and we ship them out for free um, once you purchase them. Um, shout out to the Mod Squad, man. I will be going live tonight. I will be dropping um, more content um, later on, man. Hey, y'all be safe out there on this Saturday, man. It's very dangerous out there. Hey, Sparks, heal up, man. Um, prayers out to Sparks. Keep healing. Be easy, baby. Keep healing. My mind is my nine, man. Y'all already know, man. I'm out.